Hey, what's up, guys? Um, today we're going to be playing some Resident Evil 4. Uh, if the quality isn't too perfect, I'm going to have it improved here soon. Uh, I just got to get the supplies and everything for my Dazzle, which I'm going to be looking into today. But, uh, we're going to start off the first episode of Resident Evil. So, uh, yeah, let's begin. Resident Evil 4 Alright, thank you. Blew out my eardrums. 1998. I'll never forget it. It was the year when those grisly murders occurred in the Arclay Mountains. Soon after, the news was out to the whole world, revealing that it was the fault of a secret viral experiment conducted by the international pharmaceutical enterprise, Umbrella. The virus broke out in a nearby mountain community, Raccoon City, and hit the peaceful little town with a devastating blow crippling its very foundation. Not taking any chances, the President of the United States ordered a contingency plan to sterilize Raccoon City. With the whole affair gone public, the United States government issued an indefinite suspension of business decree to Umbrella. Soon its stock prices crashed, and for all intents and purposes, Umbrella was finished. Six years have passed since that horrendous incident. I received special training via a secret organization working under the direct control of the president. I was to assume the responsibility of protecting the new president's family. Come on, why am I the one who always gets the shot in my stick? Yo, who are you really? Alright, I'm sorry, I had to skip that, because I really want to change my volume settings if I need now. Uh, brightness adjust, controller setup, um, screen settings, of course not, oh, there we go, let's do some of that. Alright, but also... There is no volume setting, so I'm sorry, uh, my voice is going to be a little bit quiet compared to, um, compared to, uh, the game. I don't know why you can't change your volume settings, and I don't know why it's coming out at full blast, but, oh well. It's going to be a bit harder for me, because I am playing from a computer screen, just so you know. If, if I do sound kind of close to the mic, that's because I'm as close as possible. And if my voice sounds a little strange, that's because I have rubber bands in my mouth. My braces. But... I said knife this faggot. Uh, excuse me. Sir? Wondering if you might recognize a girl in this photograph? Que carajo estás haciendo aquí? Lórgate, cabrón! Sorry to have bothered you. Freeze! I said freeze! Is everything okay? There was a hostile local. I had no choice but to neutralize him. 
There are still others surrounding the area. Get out of there and head toward the village. Take whatever measures necessary to save the subject. Understood. I am playing this on the PS3, just in case you wanted to know. So I do have to get splitters, so I can play for my TV, and everything should be better. Oh. Oh, I need to go upstairs. Let's check this guy. I think he has something. Not so sure. Oh, no. There might be ammo up here. I think they're, yep, pistol ammo right there. <clears throat> really, what I didn't understand in this game is why the, uh, the shopkeeper or whatever he is, why he didn't have any ammo. I guess I didn't understand that. I'm trying to conserve my ammo here. But, come over here and... And the quality is probably pretty bad because for some reason it's recording on like blow your ear out volume. I'm just gonna have to edit the quality and it might sound a little fuzzy also. There's a bunch of zombies over here. Don't really want to kill them because I don't feel like using my ammo. Because I need my ammo for other parts. There is a save right there. Now let's just take him out. And if you're playing this as well, while you're going along with this video or something, uh, I really recommend you save that dog. Don't leave it there. I don't want to tell you why, but he is very necessary and will help you out a bunch. So do save this dog up here. I haven't beaten the game fully yet, but I have gotten kind of far, so I do know what I'm doing and it won't be so boring. I just don't remember all the puzzles. And if you can hear me breathing, I'm really sorry. Like I said, it's really close to my mouth. Not sure if you can skip it and not save him, but just just save him. I always hate checking this house because the music's always happening. Reload here. Nice, they both dropped ammo. Thank you. 
I think I don't see you in there. <laughs> Alright. Some more ammo. This game's just being generous right now. I swear. Alright, so let's continue. I believe we're going to the village, maybe? Now that symbol on those on that door, you want to remember that symbol. I didn't know this, but that symbol is actually very important. Um, I don't feel like, uh, killing all these zombies, so I'll have to kill them later. Plus, I don't believe there's anything important in this city, like any ammo or anything, because we looked around before. I mean, there's a box there, but I, that's only, like, one or two. Plus, later on in the game, they just spawn back anyway, so... Oh. I don't feel like fighting that chainsaw guy, really. I do have 71 pistol ammo, but still... Oh my god. That wasn't a good idea. That was not a good idea. Chainsaw guy already. This is depressing. I'm using all my green herbs already. Hear all them freaking swings? People are swinging at me like crazy. That symbol is the symbol you want to remember. Oh, just got another one on us. Okay, so where am I? Where am I supposed to be going here? It's hard playing on this computer screen. Alright, that's not a bad deal right there. Okay, I guess I have to kill everybody in the city, and I guess I have to kill a chainsaw guy already. Time to look around. Ah, Odin. So many zombies in the city right now. Ah, tons. Odin. Just tons of them. Ah, Odin. So many zombies. Once I can, once I get my splitters and stuff, I'll be a lot better and actually be able to see what I'm doing a lot better. Okay, no 
need to look. I already know what's gonna happen. I'm gonna get raped. Hold in. How come they can hit you from so far away? Three deaths already. Uh, I wish there wasn't as many zombies at this part. It'd be a lot easier. Let's give it a go. Gotta get those headshots. How? Why is there so many? God dang. I don't think that this is such a necessity to have two billion zombies here. I believe this is where I need to go. Let me see on my mini map. I'm not sure this is exactly where I need to go. Let me see here. So really, I just need to get to there. Which I basically have to kill every one of these zombies. Where's the other one? Holy crap. Yeah, I hear the chainsaw there right up here.
Oh yeah, there we go. Thank you. That's right, you just have to like fend off zombies till this bell rings. Where's everyone going? Bingo? some bad news. I've confirmed the body of an officer. Something's happened to the people here. Leon, you need to get out of there. Look for a tower and follow the trail near it. Got it. Which is right here. Oh, wrong one. Alright, let's eat a green herb or use a green herb. Um, I thought I saw one dropped. Maybe that was just me. Alright, well, I guess we might as well check the houses. Nothing. Um. Ammo. Always helpful. since I just went through like a hundred rounds for no reason. Really a red herb. I already have one. Oh, I never, I never came in here. It's pretty cool. So, any other houses to go check or get in? Not looking like it. Oh, yeah. So this is my this is only my second time playing through this, so I am still a bit rusty. I'm not perfectly Shotgun chills, that's not a bad deal. Alright, let's... Oh, barrel hidden in the corner. And gave me a green herb, thank you. Green herbs and ammo are the only things that I care about. Oh, there's something behind this. Never mind. I think I already came from here. No, I didn't. I mean, you never know. Ammo, thank you. Upstairs, I bet you someone... Nah, I don't think any zombies can still be here. Oh, nice! God. This helped a bunch. Searching around. I already got a shotgun, which my last gameplay, I had to play for one. More shotgun shells. Nice. Loving it.
Okay. Guess we're gonna continue through the door and exit the village. Should probably buy the villagers map or whatever that thing is. I really hate those chainsaw guys though. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and do a save here, and that's gonna end episode one. So, I hope you guys enjoyed, and uh, leave me some good feedback, and be ready for episode two, which is going to be out here pretty soon.